lucky no one ever found this place. Whole thing would be a tourist attraction. Go. You gotta admit, this is pretty cool. Just a little higher. We can swing off that branch. All right, back in business. Okay, hold on. I better not call to my death over here. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Wow, Avery wasn't much for her subtlety or understatement, was he? Well, he had the money. You got it, flown it, right? Come on, let's get a closer look. Oh, look, the main entrance is blocked by debris. Again. Well, I guess Avery's builders clearly didn't take hundreds of years of erosion into account. Clearly. I need to find another way around. Hey, Sam. Come on, give me a hand with this. Yeah, sure. Sure thing. Jeez. Well, lots of lifting and crawling under things, huh? The glamorous life of a treasure hunter. <clears throat> what do you suppose this place was? These arches remind me of the St. Dismas Cathedral, but uh, I don't know. Oh, rope bridge up there. 
Yes, it is. Come on. <clears throat> See what you can find up there. You got it. Well, there's a path. But I don't see another way up yet. So, hold on. Sam! You okay? At least I'm on the other side. Okay. Uh, still need to get you up here. Hang tight. Sam! Anything? Sam, hey! You still there? God damn it. Let's see here. I ruined my marriage. Drove my best friend away. Got two psychos in their army after me. And now my brother's gone missing. Not on the bright side, there's... No. You're already up here? Where were you? I was finding a way to get you up here. All right, just jump across then. Thanks. Everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Let's keep going. Okay. Dad, we don't need that. You're already up here. Let's, let's keep going. Where I tried to go. Couldn't find a way through, though. A sec. <coughs> Sam! No good, it's a dead end. Oh, All right, we'll head on back then. <coughs> There's a path down here. This way. Nice job. Sam, in here. Got it. Looks like we're still on the right track. How the hell did no one find this? I can't say I did. Looks like we're heading down. Careful. 
the second biggest sister and I have ever seen. Wait, wait, where was the biggest? I'll tell you later. Come on, let's get down there. Sam, come around this way. Holy shit! <laughs> All right. Doing okay? Yeah. Piece of cake. Wow, what is all this? Sam, check out this diorama. Uh, that looks like a city street. I think they actually built all this stuff. With these guys, I don't know anymore. It's really well made. Blueprints. Well, brown prints. Sam, look. Hey, uh, maybe they were planning a massive theme park? Pirate land. The supplies in here. Tools, seeds. Uh, provisions probably past their sell by date. Hmm. Another, we're getting in there. Let's just lift it together, all right? Okay. Okay, let's do this. Oh, come on, this is heavy. Just think about all that treasure. Yeah, mostly just thinking about my back. <sighs> Shit. Whoa. That looks like we got ourselves another trial. Sure looks like it. Let's see what these do. Okay. So ah, they turn the symbols. That'll help. Symbols on the spheres don't match the ones in the light.
Johnny uh, Baldridge, all Basra. Tell me that guy's name. So who was this Al Basra character? Uh, he was a muggle. Soldiers on the What's he doing teaming up with Avery? Stories have it he was taken to be executed. He got freed during the battle and blew up the Dunsway's gunpowder cache. Oh, so grateful Avery brought him along? Exactly. What about that other guy? Where he started as nobody? Maybe he's gonna hear some sort. Constantly rotating. Bin Malik guy. Looks Moorish. Uh, yeah, that he is. What's he doing so far from the Barbary Coast? Hey, it was us. Coming to where the action is. I think you got it. feeling that our friend was a bit of a narcissist. You think? <laughs> yeah. Let's go see what he's got in store for us. Oh, that's, uh, that's a long way down. <laughs> so, Nathan, and be honest with me, how does this stack up, you know, compared to your other adventures? <laughs> Ask me again when we finish. Snap. Sweet. Boat's down there. After you, Captain.
Okay. Island with monstrous Avery statue is to the right. I'm so excited, my hand. My hands are literally shaking. Yeah, I know the feeling. It's either that or I just, you know, I need another cigarette. Maybe a little bit of both. Looks like he's got a spyglass, but he's not really looking for it. Maybe he wants us to look through it. Treasure Island, eat your heart out. No, no, no. You do the honors. I insist. Come on. <laughs> okay. Alley <-oop. clears throat> All right, Captain. What are we looking at? There. So? Big skull shaped island? What? Big island? <clears throat> no skull. That's gotta be it. The battalion. <laughs> That's optimistic considering everything. You know, it is just us here. You're allowed to feel just a little bit of excitement over this. Well, I'll get excited when we get Alcazar's noose off your neck. One. <laughs> okay. What? I said okay. No, 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 no. Your okays are never just okay. It usually means the opposite of okay. Rafe? Who the hell else? Supply box. Oh, my God. Of course. Everything's gone. Maybe that's a good sign. Maybe Sam too. Shit. Just 
پشت رو چه از پشت رو Parvis Magna, Sam. No, no. No, 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 no. Don't 
shit! That's a, that's a long way. Long way down. That should hold. Let's hope. Please work. Please work! Go! Oh. Oh. to now. It's not reassuring. Oh, hey. Seen anyone come by here? Tall, lanky, full of big, stupid ideas about pirate treasure? Bad luck, huh? Bastards. Are you trying to climb up there? In those boots? I'm sure you don't need this. <laughs> I 
It's working. Almost there. Jungle over there, eh? It's all moving. I don't see anything. Damn it. All right, everyone. False alarm. But keep an eye out.
Unrobot. Are you trying to give away our position? I'm just trying to infuse some culture here. Keep your culture to yourself. Fellas, a lot of you. Okay, where to? Oh, what's 
this? Wow, that is pretty dark. Seems like Burns' crew had about as much luck as me with this treasure. Shut your head off. Sam, you're okay. Yeah, nothing I can't walk away from. It's good to see you're alive, little brother. Come on, we got a treasure to find. Hold up, man. I mean, what are we doing? What do you mean? I mean, our supplies are at the bottom of the Indian Ocean. Okay, so we go steal some from Nadine's army. Yeah, and there's that. We're going up against an army. We've been holding our own so far. While being marooned in the middle of nowhere. We were trying to get here, remember? When we had an escape plan. Just hear me out. Crazy suggestion. Let's go down there and at least secure one of Rafe's boats. The boats can wait. You want to know what we're doing here? We are buying my life back. Okay, and we're going to do that by stepping into that jungle and finding the battalion. You? Even seen any signs of a massive pirate colony? Because I sure the hell haven't. It's a little late to start developing doubts, don't you think? But can we at least acknowledge the chance that maybe Avery's idea for a secret pirate utopia didn't pan out? <laughs> and maybe we're just swept up in this fantasy when instead we should be looking for a real way to save you. I'm gonna scour this island inch by inch if I have to until I find that treasure. Now, if you're confused about what you're doing here, then you can go home, Nathan. Wait, 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 I can go home? Are you kidding me? Do you have any idea what I put on the line to get you here? About what I put on the line, okay? The last 15 years of my this life. This has nothing to do with that. It has everything to do with that. Holy crap. You still want to go home? Let's just see what else we can find. This way, Nathan. Sam, up here. I'm coming. Well, no one's home. This place has seen better days, huh? Yeah, the roof could use some work. Sam, this way. Ah, yeah, that's not happening. Hey, Nathan, I think there's a way through here. Nathan, this way. <coughs> Rusty. Oh, all this crawling's a good workout for my quads. No straw, huh? Yep, some honest to God masonry in here. Well, where does masons go? <laughs> I mean, you have a tip on that, so you go. 
good carpenters among them, and coopers, but not masons. But I wouldn't give for a camera. Well, we have one. Shut your mouth. Serious? Yeah, yeah. It's on the boat with the rest of our stuff. Oh, thanks. Come on. Oh, feels good to stretch out again. Yeah, you said it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a crate. I got an idea. Here we go. Heads up! All right, we're in business. You're gonna want to see this. No houses, wide street. Clearly a commercial district of some kind. Yes, thank you for that, Nathan. Come on. What do you see? You just want to hear me say it, don't you? Really want to hear you say it. All right. Libertalia. <laughs> Libertalia! The long lost legendary pirate utopia discovered after 300 years by one Samuel Drake. And? And, and his. Younger, slightly less charming brother who happened to be tagging along for the ride. You know, I always knew you'd make something of yourself one day. Yeah, just so you know, it's not my first lost city. You should, should, should just enjoy the moment. So, where do you want to start? How about that building right over there? Oh, you mean the one with the massive guard tower? Yeah. I say we go see what it was guarding. Works for me. This is... I mean, I'm speechless. Holy goddamn shit, Nathan! <laughs> That's your idea of speechless? God, how long do you think it took them to build this place? Years. Decades. How the hell did they keep it a secret all that time? <laughs> Hey, Sam, check it out. Blacksmith Forge. Making some cutlasses here. A vest, you dirty dog. <laughs> nice. I was doing the... Oh, yeah, no, I know. I was doing the thing. Right, right. You're a horrible pirate. You suppose they trade with other colonies? Uh, if they did, they didn't do it on this island. Otherwise, word would have gotten out about the place. Well, looks like we found the local watering hole. Pirates will be pirates. Rough place. Broken tables, broken glasses. <sighs> Not a bad view. Hey. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, cheers. What are they doing here? What we call this? Yeah. I mean, you throw your lot in with these infamous outlaws, <laughs> then what? You know, take a load off, 
find some refuge, enjoy a little grog. <laughs> it's far worse fates. Yeah, I guess. Except you have to see Avery statue every day. <laughs> Hey, you, uh, you ever wonder, like, with different choices, how we might have ended up? I mean, like you taking your magic show on the road? <laughs> no, that was a that was an option. I was good. <laughs> it was not a viable option. What, you know what? You're just jealous. Uh, you always were. <laughs> no, but I mean, what would our lives have been like if we hadn't started by chasing these... People have been dead for hundreds of years. You think it would resemble more of a normal life? Mm. Normal. You've got everybody gathered around the table for Thanksgiving, exchanging all the baby photos, something like that. No, no, thank you. Not for me. I like the hand we've been dealt. Yeah, I've heard that before. Come on, we're, we're fortunate, man. <laughs> this is fortunate. Yeah, I mean, of course, I've been locked up for the last 15 years, so it's all relative, I suppose. <laughs> all right, well, I'll give you that. This is much better than prison. <laughs> well, my mugs run dry. Yeah, I was about to say, service here is lousy. Locked, of course. Hey, looks like there's a path or something through there. It's even a pirate utopia needs a place to lock up riffraff. <laughs> Can you imagine who pirates put in prison? That's a little hypocritical, don't you think? Pirates having a jail? Well, I guess every group has its assholes. This way, follow me. There's a tunnel through there. Hey, Sam, come here. This looks promising. Right behind you. This is unusual. These tunnels look a lot rougher than the rest of the colony. Kind of like they were built in a hurry. 
Looks like a hideout of some kind. Yeah, but who would they be hiding out from? Themselves? Look at this. Looks like the layout of the commercial district. Uh, and boom, there's our treasury right there. See, there's the tower. What were these guys up to? That's our way out of here. I see some light down below. Holy shit. Hey! Uh, I found more of the colony.
all of them. Grab any ammo you can. That won't be the last of them. Either they're looking for us or the treasure. <laughs> no and Rafe? Both. Anymore? Or are we clear? I think we're clear. You all right? Yeah. It's a little winded. Sam. Is that thing steady? Steady as anything else around here. Oh, okay, so no. All right, all right. Here I come. Hey, dude. Got some more friends up ahead. Aina. This whole place is falling apart. What's up, man? It's an old building over the edge. Hey. You ever done anything like this? No. I've thrown a couple of governments into villages. This is something else. Hang on. Stay sharp. Let's keep this jaw nice and tidy for the boss way.
No way I admit it. Over there, eh? Hello? Hey, you okay? No. <laughs> That's it. For now. Just better keep moving. Over here. Come on, ready? Ready. All right. Thanks. Careful, it's a long way down. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Oh, oh, crap! Whew. Watch that first step. It's a doozy. Yeah. Ladder's busted in the middle. We'll make do. Keep heading up. How you doing back there? It's a hell of a view. Nice. There you go, big brother. Try to keep up, huh? Hey, don't forget who taught you how to do that, huh? You little punk. <laughs> Trust me and follow my lead, okay? So, do all of that then? Yeah, something like that. We're definitely in the high rent district now. Not residential, though. Think some kind of administration building? Probably. Maybe Libertalia had a zoning committee. Yeah. Maybe they paid taxes. Who knows? Nothing up here. <clears throat> no way through up here either. This must have taken years and years to build. <laughs> that was great piles of money. Comes no responsibility. Or restraint, apparently. Yeesh. Yeah, well, money can't buy taste.
crap. Some of them, anyway. Jesus. Cannons, improvised barricades. What the hell happened here? Some kind of battle. It's a rhetorical question. The real question is who's fighting who? Why? Man, this is impressive. Uh, to say the least. Empty. Of course it is. You think Rafe? No. Nothing's been touched in here for hundreds of years. Right. Well, search for clues? Yeah, search for clues. Thief. What's this? Old manifest. What's the treasure? Empty. Captain Avery. You've certainly seen better days. Found something. Oh, I'm amazed this letter's still intact. Hey, Nathan, check it out. What do you got? The battalion money. It says Avery Sigil on it. Mm -hmm. Must have melted down the gold, minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves, the treasure was here. Yeah. Leaves the bigger question. Where is it now? Okay. So we know that there was fighting outside. Yeah, Dan, inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look. There's Avery. Two. Founders of Libertalia. All marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant. Thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, Treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. What? Where? It's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's a map of Libertalia. All right, so follow it to the other side of the island there. Look, right there. New Devon. Wait, Avery was from Devon, England. He sure was. Man, those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. <laughs> you say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Hmm. 
Now, how do we get up there? I got an idea. You give me a hand with this? Okay. Okay, ready? Okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. Good idea. <laughs> I'm surprised. Just take the compliment. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Now the place is looking classy. <laughs> Tarzan. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. Oh, so I am. Shock the stairs are intact. Hey, hey, hey. Don't jinx us. Oops. Like I said. <laughs> Nathan! You seeing this tower? Sure am. Sam? Yeah? All right, just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. <laughs> just about there. <laughs> sure is excited. Hey, can you get me up there? You bet. Ready? Ready. All right. I found something. Hey, stand back. Here you go. Come on. Oh. Quite the crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, why do you say we go rob from the rich, huh? Hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. Uh, how long do you think it'll take us to get the new devil? A uh, couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way.
of us? Really? What gives you that idea? Down here, quick! Don't wait, just go! Nathan! Nathan! Get up, brother, we gotta go! We gotta go! Now! Let's try this again. Mango! Mango! What are you on about? Oh, it's my safe word. Mm. Are you always this clever? I have my moments. Yes. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island. Shame we're not on the same side. Wait, there's, there's still time. Trust a trick. I'm not falling for that again. Hey, hey just, just let's talk about it. <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I'll just uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. I'm tired of silence. I'm tired of your brother.
You're fast, but you're not that fast. Hey, forget about her. Come on, we gotta get out of here before they... Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everybody just... just calm down, okay? Well, this is interesting. Nate? Samuel? The gun's down! All of you! No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. Oh, so be it. Not another step! You mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! It's done! Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. Come on, now you're a businessman. Let's just, let's work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. I'd love to hear what you have in mind. Oh, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just... I... You want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. <laughs> the gauchos on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. He did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied? You lied to your baby brother? We're wasting time! Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking for Avery's treasure. I just kept running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden, and your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down a second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. Uh, oh, yeah? No, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no, no. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always I ours. I left my light for you! <laughs> hey, look, look, Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini me, he you. And that old man back into the mix, and I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, <clears throat> all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves digging around where we shouldn't. Rafe? What? One way or another, end it. Or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself. Keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. You're half right. I just need Sam. Wait, now you're making a mistake. Don't, you don't, don't listen! Oh my god. 
Nate! Hey! Nate! There it is. Who the hell lives here anyway? I have no idea. But this is definitely the address. Been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. <sighs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? Start by finding a way in. And then we can take the grand tour. You think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking a window. It was worth a try. <clears throat> All right, let's look around back, huh? Hey, Nathan, look, it's an open window. Oh, yeah. Here, follow me. Okay, give me your hand. All right, there you go. Come on, Nathan. Whoa. <laughs> Spooky. Well, here. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals. Any kind of research papers, you know? Hmm, nothing in here. Nope. It's not gonna be inside it. Boxes are filled with old track and camping equipment. Down we go. So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but... It's such a large place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. <sighs> Here we go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of Mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking.
Was this your house? Hey, these boxes remind you of anything? Every place we ever lived. Exactly. I remember Dad was always like, why bother unpacking? We're just gonna move again in a month. Yep, always the asshole. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah, it's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right. Uh, we we'll budge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Push! Push! What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Sam, this is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> hmm, huh. this one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Hmm. And you recognize that one? Uh. I've seen something like it before. Reclining figures. It's Etruscan. Ah, uh, that's right. Yeah. Husband and wife. They're buried together. It's kind of dark. In like an awesome sort of way. <laughs> yeah. This place is like a damn museum. <laughs> Think they've got a dinosaur wing? Wouldn't surprise me. Here's another one. <sighs> nope. I do believe this is an ancient Mesopotamian washer dryer combo. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston, come on. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Hey, check it out. <laughs> so where are we going? Huh? Well, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you pick? Anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, well. Here we go. India. Yeah, we'll visit the Taj Mahal. I just read this one. Oh, yeah? Is it any good? It's kind of incredible. It's about the first Western woman to visit Lhasa. <sighs> it's hot in there. Give to get an invite like this. Fertility totems. Hey, aren't you a little young to be looking at that stuff? Wow. This table is as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. 
bet the food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Prince of Arabia. Always wanted to see that flick. Jousting armor. Looks French. Hey, maybe don't go waving your flashlight around the windows too much. These compass, sundial. Just imagine being lost at sea. And those instruments are the only thing standing between death and salvation. Yeah. It's crazy. Hey, they've got your favorite book here. Really? Which one? A general history of the robberies and murders of the most notorious pirates. Yeah, more like a generally made up history. Even the author's name is a fake. Fake or not, this looks like a first edition. Are you serious? Man, this place, man, wow. Wanna take it with you? <laughs> nah. It'll just disintegrate in my backpack. A dragon gong. Hmm. Huh. Looks like it's from Southeast Asia. Going it alone. Liven up the place. Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Can you imagine being the one to actually uncover these things? <laughs> Must be something, right? Oh, wow. They knew Amelia Earhart? No kidding. Man, they knew all the cool people. Okay. I don't think mom's journals are anywhere in here. Let's, uh, let's check upstairs. <laughs> hmm, it's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. Hey, the air vent, up there. Oh yeah, that could get us into the room below it. Not us, you. What? I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can I handle it? All right, let's see what you got then. Ready? Oh, oops. 
it's a Polaroid. Yeah, let me see. I think it still works. Yeah, come here. Now smile, all right? <laughs> Don't lose it. Fall. Oh no. Lock from this side, too. And look around. Is there a key nearby? Huh. Coding. Lots of painkillers. Anything? Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. Wow. Ah, journals galore. Well, let's see what we find. something <laughs> This is it Paradise? Definitely mom's handwriting. 
Put up your hands. Slowly. Hey, hey, hey. There's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, hey, hey. You keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady, it was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, that, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh... Hi? My god! <coughs> I could have shot you! Yeah, you still might, so, uh... Do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate's secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs>